Hey, good morning everybody and welcome back to the channel. I am just out on a beautiful spring Sunday morning. Gonna get a couple of sunrise uh, images right here by Loon Lake at Silver Spring State Park. And also I'm shooting a time lapse right now, shooting right over the lake. I've got this tree right there in the right third of the uh, image of the time lapse. So I'm gonna be doing that um, with my M50 right now. But while I'm doing that, and while the sun's, the sun's actually on its way up right now, so I'm going to uh, get some still images of the sunrise. Then I'm gonna walk around the park a little bit and uh, try to get some macro images. And this is also the time of year when the geese are having babies or goslings, whatever you wanna call it. And uh, they're really cute little yellow fur balls, really. Um, so, just gonna see if there's any baby geese running around here. Try to get some images of uh, those guys. Got my 70 to 200 uh, lens that I would use to shoot that. Got my macro lens for shooting macro, and I've got my 2470 just for uh, whatever else gets uh, in my way. <laughs> so that's what I'm doing today. Thank you very much for stopping by, and uh, here we go. Every spring when the water gets to the right temperature, they'll come out and they'll stock these ponds with little bait fish just to keep the ecology of the pond going. And uh, I'm thinking that they must have done that maybe uh, yesterday or in the last uh, week or so. Just seeing lots of little uh, uh, bait fish just kind of jumping out of the water. It's kind of neat. So you, yeah, you don't have to wait too long. They're jumping all over the place. It's kind of funny. Not much of a sunrise so far, so I'm gonna get a couple of images. We'll we'll wait a little bit to see what's gonna happen with the sunrise. I think I'm gonna walk down the path and uh, see if there's some shots down there. You can hear the geese, so I, I still don't know if there's any uh, goslings running around or not, but uh, I'll uh, I'll find out and then we'll go shoot some macro. All right, so after I shot the sunrise right over there, right behind the camera, looking out over the pond, um, I just noticed these dandelions here in the tall grass. So put the macro lens on and focusing right on the dandelion. I found one that has one little like seedling about ready to escape, you know, blow off in the wind. So I thought that was kind of a cool image, added a little bit of interest to it. And um, I shot it, I went down to F4 and up to F11. And fortunately, uh, there's like zero wind. So I had a longer shutter speed. One of them was like about a half of a second. So I didn't have to worry about the subject blowing in the wind. So really got lucky with that. And uh, I think they're gonna be pretty nice shots. So. I will uh, put those up right now. All right, so <laughs> I started walking up this way. I was going to go down this path and look for some more macro shots. And right out of the uh, tall grass over there, some baby geese came out. So I've got to get my uh, 70 to 200 done and see if I can get some shots of them. Obviously you can't get too close. You don't want to disturb them. So pretty cool. They're so cute. I've gotten some shots of them before uh, over the years, but uh, it's always fun to come do.
all right so i was on my way out i just left that uh, side of the park it's going to drive to the other side of the park where there's a great big open field with all kinds of uh, spring foliage spring growth uh, wild flowers that, that kind of thing so i'm still going to go over there but as i was driving by here i saw all these blue purplish uh, flowers so gonna put the macro lens back on go out here get a couple of macro shots and uh, then head over to the other wildflowers on the other side of the park All right, so I found a tranquil little beautiful scene right here. I was uh, originally just shooting the macros. Those purple flowers are just beautiful. But then I kind of backed off a little bit and uh, just this scene kind of unfolded right in front of my eyes. I really love how the, the trees are. We've got some symmetry in the trees and the one tree, right hand tree, kind of actually all the trees they kind of encircle these purple flowers and almost like are giving the flowers a hug almost it's kind of what it feels like so uh yeah pretty cool i don't know if i've ever seen trees hugging flowers but that's what i'm seeing right now so uh the light is just gorgeous and uh whatever i don't not too much else to say about it. It's just a beautiful, beautiful scene and uh, lucky enough to have both lenses so I can shoot it macro and shoot it with my 2470 and just capture this pretty scene. So I'll put those up for you now. All right, everybody. Hey, that's going to do it. We got some great images. Hope you enjoyed them. With that, I am Garrick, and I am your very best friend in the whole wide world. So hit that subscribe, hit the like, drop me a comment. Let me know how you're doing, and we'll see you next time, everybody. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.